Breaking news now here on RT International. We're just hearing that Mikhail Kalashnikov, the designer of the world's most used assault rifle, the AK-47, has died aged 94. His 60-year-old invention has become a cultural icon, and Kalashnikov was acknowledged for services to his country, receiving countless awards, including the acclaimed Lenin Prize. Artis Yegor Piskanov has more. The man behind a weapon that many say changed the face of combat. Produced in over a dozen states and officially used by 50 armies, it's the most popular and reliable small arm in the world. No competition. AK-47, short for Avtomat Kalashnikov model 1947, the year it was designed. But the inspiration came a few years earlier, during the war against Nazi Germany. This is when 21-year-old Red Army tank commander Mikhail Kalashnikov was wounded in battle and was recovering in hospital, dreaming of designing a weapon that would help throw the invaders out. And so he did. His automatic rifle combined the best features of machine and submachine guns, killing power, lightweight, durability and simplicity. Often during the Vietnam War, American soldiers took AKs from dead Vietnamese troops, preferring Kalashnikovs to their own sophisticated but unreliable M16s. When the USSR collapsed, the AK began to be sold on the cheap throughout Latin America, the Middle East and Africa, where they were used by fighters in ethnic conflicts, and in some countries by drug gangs and terrorists. On Al-Qaeda footage, Osama bin Laden was often seen with a Kalashnikov rifle. Nowadays, the gun is believed to be responsible for a quarter of a million deaths every year. This always upset Mikhail Kalashnikov, who called for tougher UN measures to halt the illicit distribution of small arms. Weapons should only be in the hands of those people who defend their country. That is to defend, not to attack. I designed the rifle not for international conflicts, but to protect the borders of my homeland. Kalashnikov designed different models of the gun, but what unites them all is their simplicity and reliability. The assault rifle even became a cultural icon. It's depicted on the flag and coat of arms of several countries and organizations. Mikhail Kalashnikov had many honors, including the highest state award, the Golden Star of the Hero of Russia. But despite such astonishing fame and respect, unbelievably, he didn't make a penny from the sale of his weapons. The only way he could profit from his invention was by allowing to use his name to promote various brands, watches, MP3 players, and even vodka. But without a doubt, his legacy is the AK-47. Its production continues to this day, and the gun's reputation as the world's top infantry weapon remains unchallenged. Igor Piskunov, RT.